if a normal person, if their brain were the ocean, a lot of times they'd be a snorkeler. They're going on the surface. Sure, they're still under the water thinking about things, observing things, understanding things, but they're not diving particularly deep. And this isn't me calling neurotypical people shallow. I'm saying that autistic people dive so deep into whatever they're thinking about, feeling about, learning about, hoping about, dreaming about, that you can essentially get the mental bends when you try to come up. I'm serious here. Autistic people are like scuba divers. Neurotypical people are like snorkelers. It means that autistic people can observe and learn and think about and grow in areas sometimes really fast by diving super deep into the subject. While um, normies might struggle to do that as easily, but they can get from place to place. I don't think I'm explaining this very well. I'm sure people are going to be like, you're not doing a good job at that. But I think I get what you're talking about. So much of autistic traits can be explained by this idea of diving deep, having trouble with change. Well, you've dove deep. It's hard to adjust to something else. Needing to plan things ahead of time. Yeah, because to really enjoy them, you're diving deep and you're going to get the bends if you come up too fast. Hyperfixations and special interests and just in general being obsessed over things. Yeah. Why would you like something at a surface level when you can get super obsessed with it <laughs> and dive deep? And that is something that is seen as incredibly holy in religion. However, you are expected to be able to move from place to place at the same time. They want you to be obsessed with reading your Bible, but you're supposed to be able to do it for five minutes a day and then move on to something else if you need to. You're supposed to want to memorize the Bible, but you should be able to just take it in small pieces in Sunday school. You're supposed to want to worship all day long, but if you go to church, you're only supposed to worship for a few songs. Everything is set up in small bite-sized pieces, but yet you get rewarded for diving deep, which makes it a minefield. That reminds me of a child that I knew who didn't like to memorize just one verse of the Bible and would prefer to memorize the whole chapter. Was that child you? That was me. Yes, it was me. Hi, Sadie. <laughs> because it, it, it flows better and gets you more points at summer camp.